Hello guys, good afternoon guys, welcome back to my channel. Guys, in this video, we're gonna do a different kind of PG guys. Uh, maybe you're gonna ask why I'm holding my ukulele. This is my favorite ukulele guys. Uh, it's made from Enya and it's a um, tenor size. I've got some soprano, I've got some... What is on the middle? Um, <laughs> I forgot. Soprano, concert, and then the, the tenor. So this is the one that I'm always using all the time. I'm doing live streaming on YouTube and Facebook and TikTok. If you want to follow me guys on my uh, YouTube channel, uh, follow my, subscribe to my YouTube channel and then follow on my Facebook page or, and uh, my TikTok account. So it's all in the link on the description guys. Yeah, so guys, um, this video guys is about my um, favorite ukulele. As you can see, this is a normal acoustic ukulele. There's no um, pickup or preamps built in on it. And you can plug that in on the amplifier or mixer or interface, whatever. You can't plug this in. Um, but I'm still using this on my um, live streaming when I am do a song cover. And um, what I'm doing, guys, is uh, I bought... Um, a transducer as you can see this one guys hey I bought this uh, maybe years ago now and it's called a donor sounds transducer so this is the one that I'm using so you can connect them to um, interface a mixer or amps uh, it's a really nice one and it's a give a good sound but the thing is I think uh, this uh, transducer, the more it's getting old, the more it's getting weak, the sound. And I uh, put the volume of blast and it's still not a good um, more sound. What, you know what I mean, guys? It's not really loud. So when I sing, the sound of my ukulele is um, cover my microphone sound. So this one is not going to get more sound even if I just... To the mixer and then when I switch to the guitar it's gonna be full blast so yeah so this video guys is about my ukulele so today guys I'm gonna put some preamps or pick up on my favorite ukulele this is uh, my Enya and I didn't spend money to get a pickup or a preamps that you can connect to your um, ukulele uh, preamps or pick up guys, you know I'm talking about like my um, Martin guitar. Uh, there is um, things in here that you can plug into amplifier or mixer. And there's a built-in uh, preamps in here on the sound hole. But that's not on the body. As you can see, there's no hole in the body. And on my Taylor, uh, as you can see, there is a um, built-in. And you can plug it in to your mixer or amplifier. So this is what I'm going to do on this video, guys. I'm going to put some a pickup on my favorite ukulele. What I'm going to do, guys, uh, I didn't spend a pickup or um, preamps to put on my ukulele. What I've done, guys, is uh, I've got a donor a ukulele. Uh, this is not a sponsored donor ukulele. I bought this years and years ago and I'm not using this and this is uh, there's a built-in preamps on it from here but what I did I removed them <laughs> which is this one guys so this 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 pickup guys is from here and there's another one on the bottom as well which is this one from here so I take this off from my donor ukulele this is made from donor and it's a really nice concert ukulele the 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 i like the pret because it's a bit wide like my uh, co, uh like my um, tenor because i'm playing tenor size because my finger is a bit um chunky <laughs> they call chunky yeah so i removed this um pickup from here and another one from here and i'm gonna put that on my enya ukulele so let's put this bag on the bag and let's go back to 
anyway guys this ukulele i'm not using this since i bought it i, I don't use it so um in case of uh, buying a pickup from amazon or ebay whatever i just removed the uh, pickup from my donor ukulele which is this one guys so this is the one that i'm gonna put on my um enya ukulele but the big problem guys is um this is the first time i'm gonna do this guys we're gonna make a hole in here and we're gonna make a hole in here to fit this um, preamps here and this um, plug in quarter inch here on the bottom so like I said guys this is my first time I'm gonna do this I know how to restring guitar and ukulele but uh, making a hole in a ukulele is a big big risk because if you make a big hole which is too big than this one it's gonna be a ruin so we're gonna do like making really nice and easy make a hole in here to fit this really nice fit because if you make a, a bigger hole than this then my ukulele is gonna be busted or useless <laughs> because I make the big hole so what we're gonna do guys we're gonna turn over to the table and we're gonna make a hole in here and I'm gonna give you and I'm gonna show you how to do that and please guys guide me to make my project nice and perfect guys so let's turn around to the table and let's do it so there you go guys uh, we are now on the table and then I'm gonna show you um, what we got everything uh, we got this um, wire uh, coming with this um, pickup and this one is said that's ukulele and you got a volume control in there and you got um, EQ and a built-in tuner so yeah I've got everything's wire and this is the other part that we're gonna um, put on the other end of the ukulele which is that you can plug into your quarter inch and then on the other end is going to the mixer or the amplifier and um, I'm gonna show you this one guys as you can see uh, this one is gonna go to your um, the body of the ukulele so what I made to make like this curve I'll get some like uh, credit card or like I don't know how do you call it like um it's look like a credit card or and then I burn it a little bit in here make a hit and then make a curve and now um, this one is gonna go in here on this side guys because as you can see that the, the body of the ukulele is curved and I'll make this uh, card to fit in here so at least you can find where is this card gonna sit properly like that and then of course um, I bought some um, masking tape so we can put a tape on here before we make a hole so yeah to make it everything's nice and easy because if you uh, dig in here without the tape the wood is not gonna be nice um, result so we have to put um, a masking tape before you uh, dig a hole on the wood so what we're gonna do first guys because my guitar is a shiny finish he's a bit um, loads of light reflecting so doesn't matter when we put the tape in there it's gonna be um, perfect so now guys I'm gonna put a uh, masking tape on the body of the ukulele and then we're gonna make a mark which is this one we're gonna make a mark in there and then we're gonna get the uh, Dremel to cut these uh, things in here and of course it's on the other side on the ukulele body there you go guys I put a tape on the ukulele body and um, I put the mark as well I um, use a pen and discard something like that because like I said I make this curve like a curb to follow the uh, body of the ukulele so I uh, put the tape and a mark now 
what I'm going to do next is I'm going to drill it and make a hole in here to uh, fit this um, um, pickup from here to the hole. So I'm going to make a hole in here guys to put this um, pickup in here. So I'm going to get ready everything. I've got my drill uh, ready and um, let's do it. Hello guys, I'm back. <laughs> I uh, make a hole already on my ukulele. As you can see, the tape is still here. And I uh, done another hole in here on the bottom, near on the strap button. Uh, this one is gonna go like here. You know, the quarter inch is gonna go in here. And then uh, plug into uh, amplifier or mixer. Uh, so I done two holes on my ukulele but I didn't show you guys how I did because otherwise the video is gonna be like you know <laughs> so I just um, skip the uh, things that I'm uh, making a hole on the ukulele so the next things guys is um, I'm gonna install the um, um, pickup and then the, I'm gonna make a hole again in here on the uh, saddle on the bridge to put this um, I don't know how you call this I I forgot how to call this uh, this is the one this one is the, gonna go on on the bridge under the nuts so the ele electric or elect also electronics can um, hear the vibration going to the um, pickup so again guys, uh, I'm going to try to install this again and then I'm going to come back again later after I install uh, this um, pickup from here. So I've done really well. I, I, I made a nice um, hole in here. It's totally like pit, not loose. It's really good. See that? I'm just going to make a little bit push and then I'm going to install on the other side as well. So I'm going to come back in a minute guys, I'm going to loose all the, the string and take this off the nuts and then make a hole in here to put these um, things, I don't know how to call this. So come back in a minute guys and I'll see you in a bit. There you go guys, it's ready to go now. So I make a hole here in the bridge to get through these um, electronic things. And on the end of here is here inside the, the sound hole. That's gonna go in the in here. And I'm gonna go in here on the side. And um, I just um, cut the nut as well. As you can see, I put some light in there. So I sand it paper until it's um, because if I didn't sand this, the action is gonna be high because of these um, electronic things. You know, I mean, guys, if you uh, uh, you know how to install a pickup from your ukulele or um, guitar, you have to cut the the uh, nuts. Otherwise, they're gonna be uh, too high. So I sand the edge. Uh, there's a line in there, so it's gonna be okay now and um, ready to go. And um, I'm gonna install the uh, pickup now and here on the other end but uh, I decided to change a string as well because as you can see my string is a bit worn see that guys my my string there's some I don't know because uh, I, I think the string is getting old so I'm gonna remove all the string but the thing is guys it's really hard to change the string because when you pull the string out, it's gonna be like this. There is a um, ball head on the end. I don't know, is it ball head, something like that? And I've got um, a killer string, which is the high G. Um, but the string that I bought is just like a plain string. Uh, yeah, there is a color coding. Uh, it's said in here, the um, the red is the A, the blue is the E, and the green is the C, and the white is the, the G, which is the high G. And um, I'm going to sort it out. 
try to put this ball head on the end of the string. It's quite um, difficult guys because I didn't expect that the string is going to be like this. Well, this one is a, is a true to the um, bridge and then going inside the ukulele. I can't show you the, the string inside guys, but it's going to be like that. So I'll come back later guys. I'm going to do the string and then after the string and then I'm going to install this and here as well the quarter inch plugin to the um, amplifier or mixer. So I'm nearly there guys and then I'm and come back again in a minute. There you go guys. I've done all my job. It's a hard work guys but it's uh, worth it. Uh, and here we go. I um, changed my string as well. It's already on the process that you have to lose all the string. So I changed my string as well. This is my old one. It looks like a carbon thing's the color. Now I've got like a really, really white string with a high G. And if I didn't change the string, to change the string is really difficult, guys. It's really hard because they all true to the bridge. So you have to take it up all the strings. So I am. Um, sand the uh, bridge or the nuts and so I changed the string and everything is um, done I removed this one already yeah so I'm not gonna use this anymore this is a donor um, sound transducer so there you go guys I'm just gonna be a little bit clean and look what I've got I've got a pickup now on my ukulele and it's working guys as you can see but it's not tuning yet so all the string is still loose I'm just gonna show you guys what I've done and I'm very proud of myself and here we go I uh, cleaned the pret as well because the pret is a little bit <laughs> dirty I'm using this ukulele I think almost a year now and here we go I've done my job nice properly and here on the bottom I'll make a mistake when I'm put the this one the quarter inch thing I drill the hole going to the body for the screw but next time guys if you uh, apply a, a pickup or anything on your body don't make a hole now this is screw it won't tight anymore <laughs> because it's already a hole in it so I think the best thing is if you got like a piece of wood, put it inside, but I don't know how it's going to work. It's really hard. Even when I'm doing the, um, changing the string, it's really hard because I have to put the string in here and then get it on the inside, take it out and then put the ball head and pull it out and everything. But this one is all right. Even if not screw, if not tight anymore or tight enough, it's all right because this one is fixed. I'm just worried about in here because this one is a plug in, plug in, plug out. You know, when you pull your quarter inch in here. So I have to be very careful with this or I can apply some glue on the edge so it won't stick on the body. But yeah, I'm always reminding this when I take it off my um, quarter inch. I had to be very careful because it might come, <laughs> it might come up, go with the, the jack. <laughs> uh, anyway, guys, I've done all my job. Uh, I'm very sorry because the video is quite long uh, because um, I show you all the process from the start up to the end, guys. So all I have to do, guys, is um, I'm going to sit on my chair and I'm going to tune my ukulele and then I'm going to test it uh, connecting to the amps and... I'm gonna show you how it sounds like here we go hello guys so this is my final um, result on my um, work for today guys as you can see on the start of this video guys this is a pure acoustic there's no uh, pickup or any um, preamps built in this uh, my favorite ukulele and I'm using a transducer which is sticking here earlier uh, from donor uh, sounds 
transducer they call sound transducer but like i said the more it's getting old it's getting weak uh, there's no um nice um sound now so i decided to get my other ukulele and get the pickup from them and put it in here so here we go guys i've got my pickup now on my ukulele and then i i uh, sand the uh, the nuts because you know when you apply um pickup on your electric or acoustic guitar or ukulele the action is gonna get higher so now the action is really nice and playable so i sand the bridge i changed my string my old string is a really nice color which is um like a carbon black and now i've got a white um, string now so i uh, keep tuning it because you know when you got a new string uh, every five minutes is out of tune but i'm still trying to uh, put them on the tune and i connected this now to my mini uh, box in here as you can see and you can hear anyway guys even if um so i connected now in here on my <laughs> very cute uh, box uh, mini amps so you can hear the sound different when the i uh, turn it on but at the moment i'm gonna retune this again because it's out of tune so i'm gonna make it really nice and quick tune There you go guys, now it's in tune, now I'm going to turn it on my um, mini amp so we can hear now the, the moment of truth if the pickup is working if you connect it to the amplifier. So here we go, I'm going to turn the volume here, there you go, it's working guys. I'm very happy what I've done today guys <laughs> now I can use my uh, ukulele now uh, connected to the amplifier mixer or um, uh, audio interface because it's there's a built-in uh, pickup now actually it's not a built-in my DIY pickup uh, I um, nick this from my other uh, ukulele tuner is working as well as you can see there's a tuner in there and it's working as well so when you turn the tuner it's not connected to the amps it's uh, they call it pass through or something like that and turn it off there you go it's connected We got some reverb. <laughs> there you go, guys. Um, I'm only worried about this. Uh, like I said earlier, when I unplug it, I have to be very careful because the screw is not tight enough. So. Maybe when I fold this uh, jack, this um, connection is going to come out. <laughs> there you go guys, success! My project for today, my hard work is almost all day I've done this um, uh, DIY how to uh, put a pickup on your uh, pure acoustic ukulele. Now it's electro-acoustic ukulele now and it's really really 
nice now i'm very very happy what i've done for today guys so again guys i'm really sorry about the video it's quite long but i'm happy and you're happy we are all happy guys so what i'm gonna say guys is thanks for watching and thanks for staying with me from the start to the end i hope you enjoy this video guys and i hope you learned something what i've done on this video guys so thanks for watching guys if you haven't subscribed to my channel guys i do really appreciate if you subscribe to my channel guys you're gonna learn lots of things in here i do song cover uh, i do a uh, ukulele tutorial and guitar tutorial and of course some stuff like i unboxing if i've got some new stuff uh, related to uh, music like pedals and everything so again guys thanks for watching hope to see you on the next one see you and have a good day